Welcome to EWTN's Religious Catalog. EWTN's founders, our beloved Mother Angelica, first brought this program into the homes of EWTN viewers in 1996. Since then, Religious Catalog has offered thousands of Catholic products, including good books, beautiful religious art, rosaries and medals, statues of Our Lord, Our Lady, the saints, and crucifixes, all designed to enrich our spiritual lives. Religious Catalog is also your source for many of the favorite programs seen here on EWTN, including exclusive series, specials, live shows, and feature films. I hope you have a blessed reminder of the love of Jesus in your house and in your heart. And now, here's Barbara McGuigan. Hello, welcome to the EWTN Religious Catalog. I'm Barbara McGuigan and I am joined by Emily Lunsford. Today we are going to look at some items regarding St. Anthony, whose feast day is June 13th. First, we have several St. Anthony outdoor statues. St. Anthony of Padua was a Franciscan friar in the 13th century, and he was canonized less than a year after his death. He is the patron saint of the poor, the elderly, travelers, and the saint who we ask to find lost articles. He was declared a doctor of the church in 1946. Each 24-inch statue is designed for indoor or outdoor use. To avoid potential damage, though, the statue should not be left in direct sun in temperatures exceeding 95 degrees Fahrenheit. It is available with a granite finish, a white finish, and in full color. And here is a St. Anthony of Padua mug. This 12 ounce ceramic mug features an image of St. Anthony and Jesus on the front with a prayer to St. Anthony on the back. It reads, O oh, gentle and loving St. Anthony, whose heart was ever full of human sympathy, whisper my petition into the ears of the sweet infant Jesus who loved to be folded in your arms and the gratitude of my heart will ever be yours. Amen. It is microwave and dishwasher safe. This St. Anthony sterling silver medal makes us think of the great saint who once said, the life of the body is the soul. The life of the soul is God. This metal measures three quarter inches and comes on a 20 inch stainless steel chain. This St. Anthony chaplet features olive wood beads. It includes prayer instructions in both English and Spanish. And here is a mercy crucifix. This unique crucifix is a wonderful rendition of a 14th century processional cross called the Misericordia Crucifix, currently on display at the Metropolitan Museum of Art. It features St. Francis at the top, the Blessed Virgin on the left, St. John the Beloved on the right, and St. Anthony of Padua at the bottom. It measures 14 and a half inches high. Next is the book, St. Anthony, the Wonder Worker of Padua by Charles Warren Stoddard. This is the popular life of the patron saint of lost objects, a powerful intercessor and one of the best loved saints of all time. It includes the famous stories of St. Anthony and the Christ child, his preaching to the fish, the miracle of the mule and many more. Emily, what do you have to show us today? I have some items regarding the founder of the Franciscan Order, St. Francis of Assisi. This is the book, St. Francis and Pope Francis, Prayer, Poverty, Joy. What do a medieval Italian Catholic and a 21st century Argentine Pope have in common? The certainty that encountering Jesus can change your life and the world. Alan Schreck, author and professor, considers the times and message of both St. Francis of Assisi and Pope Francis and invites you to experience the same freedom and joy that they have found in Jesus. This book brings together themes that are central to the mission of both these men, conversion, prayer, 
poverty, church, mission, and joy. Two men separated by 800 years, one vision. As Pope Francis said, the gospel, the gospel. And here is St. Francis of Assisi, Omnibus of Sources. This is the English omnibus of sources for the life of St. Francis of Assisi, containing the writings and early biographies of St. Francis, edited by Marion A. Habig. It is now bound into two paper-bound volumes and is a reprint of the 1972 classic. Next is Adventures in Assisi, On the Path with St. Francis, written by Amy Wellborn and illustrated by Anne Kissane Engelhardt. Gianna and Lorenzo are in Assisi for the day, in the care of their great uncle, Brother Antonio, while their parents visit a winery. At first, the children are not happy about being there, but Brother Antonio saves the day with a fun way to show the children around and teach them about the life of St. Francis. Illustrated with lush scenes of the Italian town of Assisi, this delightful tale blends history, geography, and the life of St. Francis into a faith-filled adventure. This book is recommended for ages 7 to 12. And Barbara, I see you have a DVD to show us for children as well. I do. Here is a DVD entitled Francis, the Knight of Assisi, an award-winning animated video. It is the true story of the founder of the Order of the Friars Minor and the Poor Clares. One day, Francis felt a calling to greater glory. God had vested upon him a special mission that would require a supreme act of courage. For the love of God, his king, Francis gave up all that he had and joyfully embarked upon the most exciting adventure. The running time is 30 minutes. We also have a St. Francis pet medal. This round pewter medal features an image of St. Francis with the words, St. Francis of Assisi, protector of animals, inscribed around the image. The back of the medal has a place where a jeweler can engrave your pet's name and your phone number. The medal measures one inch in diameter and attaches to your pet's collar with a spring clip. And here is a St. Francis with animals statue. This statue shows St. Francis in a forest surrounded by a fox, a doe, a bird, and a turtle. It measures 14 inches. And this St. Francis rosary is made with oval six millimeter brown wood beads and features a sterling silver San Damiano crucifix and St. Francis medal center. Emily, could you tell us about this cross? Yes, it is a beautiful St. Francis towel cross. St. Francis used the towel cross as a symbol of the crucifixion. This decorative cross features a beautiful image of St. Francis surrounded by birds. It measures seven and a half inches by eight and a quarter inches. And here are several other San Damiano crucifixes. This one is a beautiful three-dimensional rendition of the San Damiano crucifix, and it measures 17 and three-quarter inches high. Today, the original cross hangs in the St. Clair Church in Assisi. St. Francis was praying in front of the statue when our Lord gave St. Francis the commission to go and rebuild the church. And this is a San Damiano pendant with holy card. The set includes a San Damiano crucifix on a 28-inch gold-plated chain. On the back are the words of St. Francis, Lord, I will repair your house. The set also includes a beautiful holy card with the medal of St. Francis encased in the card. On the back of the card is St. Francis's prayer before the cross at San Damiano. We also have this small booklet, the San Damiano Cross, an explanation. Father Michael Scanlon explores the history and meaning of the San Damiano crucifix. Here is a prayer of St. Francis stone plaque. This beautiful plaque will serve as a reminder of our Christian duties. The prayer begins, Lord, make me an instrument of your peace. Where there is hatred, let me sow love. Where there is injury, pardon. It is made of stone from the Holy Land and includes a leather hanger. It measures four by eight inches. Finally, we have a St. Francis outdoor statue. It is made of resin stone mix and measures 25 and a half inches high. 
we should ask that St. Anthony and St. Francis pray for us, that we may spread the gospel to others in the way that they both did. And now here's Doug. Thanks, Emily, for first year's Mother Angelica with some classic items for our consideration. Welcome to your catalog show. And I have to tell you all the time that, <clears throat> and remind you that this is a service for you as a happy reminder. And please don't let it take the place of your contribution, huh? Okay. We have something that's very, very wonderful. We have here, as far as I can see, we had this book before, I think we advertised it, called Marian Shrines in Italy. And it represents 35 of the 1,500 Marian Shrines of Italy, including all the stories of various shrines and visions and, and visionaries. Now here are, there are 155 illustrations. Boy, look at that one, huh? I'd say Major, Mary Major, the Holy House of Nazareth, and where, you know, the angels miraculously transported that uh, to Loretto. The Floating Stone, Madonna, the story of the whole city built around a basilica. It, it was built by a lawyer who was a former Satanist priest, no less. It tells all about him. And each story in this book, this is Our Lady Virgin of the Revelation, but each story has helped her children uh, ward off terrible, terrible scourges. And we should increase our devotion to Our Lady. And our, these shrines have, have given thousands and thousands and thousands of people answered their prayers and perform many, many, many miracles. So the whole thing is to lead the pilgrims to her divine son. That's all she wants. If you're planning a visit to Italy, I would get this book. And even if you're not, at least you can read about them. And you got a good imagination, you can picture them. And this is the book to get. Now, have you heard about the glories of Mary? Huh? The glories of Mary are Frank Alphonsus Liguori. It's a big book. This is condensed. It's a new condensed version of the large book from the famous explanation of the Hail Holy Queen by Alphonsus Liguori. And here's even the mysteries of the rosary, if you have a hard time remembering them. And everything in here, what to do in time of temptation. A hope for sinners, uh, help in purgatory. Oh boy, we're all going to know that one. He writes of the glories of Mary as a defense of Our Lady's position, a traditional position. You know, certain writers of his ridiculed devotion to Mary in his time, and they criticized the Hail Holy Queen. So Alphantis goes, and in response, he made this book, and this is an abridged copy, had overwhelming effect. He quoted saints, doctors, popes, sacred scripture to prove this is the mother of God. Now, we have some of you that are, have great devotion to Our Lady already. This is a beautiful book called Mary Day by day. It's every day in the year. You know, some of you are so busy. You got to go to work early and you get up and you get, you get late, home late at night. And here's a prayer every day. Just a little bitty one. Look. It's what we call one minute meditation. Now, don't tell me you cannot afford one minute for a lady. I think you better afford it. See these little things? That's just a minute. And you need to have this book, all you that are on trains and buses and cars and blowing your horn at traffic and all that kind of stuff. Instead of blowing your horn while you're waiting, read a little thing like this. They're all from sacred scripture and the writings of the saints. So 
I'm getting late. I got through and through. Here's Doug now with a recap of everything I've spoken about and how you can get it. Thanks, Mother. Now, here's a look at the items presented on this program. First up is the St. Anthony outdoor statue, the one in granite, pictured on your screen, priced at $78. Item number 2430G, St. Anthony outdoor statue. We also have the St. Anthony outdoor statue in white, now it's priced at $70 and it's item number 2430W for the white. Or there's the St. Anthony outdoor statue in color, as you can see, pictured on your screen. Now it's priced at $116 and it's item number is 2430C for color. You have your choice there in granite, white, or color. Next up, the St. Anthony mug, priced at $9. Item number is M1409, the St. Anthony mug. Or there's the St. Anthony Sterling Silver Medal, priced at $42. Item number is P8004. We also have the St. Anthony Chaplet, priced at $10. Item number is 98W. And there's the Mercy Crucifix, priced at $38. Item number is 65130 for the Mercy Crucifix. And we have the book St. Anthony, the Wonder Worker of Padua. It's only $8. Item number is 110. That's 110, St. Anthony, the Wonder Worker of Padua. Alan Schreck, Dr. Alan Schreck, has a book, St. Francis and Pope Francis, priced at $15. Item number is T1594 for the book, St. Francis and Pope Francis. We also have St. Francis of Assisi, Omnibus of Sources. This book is priced at $60. Item number is 90862. There's also a children's book, Adventures in Assisi, priced at $16. It's featured on bookmark by Amy Wellborn. Item number 36650, Adventures in Assisi. And the popular DVD, Francis, The Night of Assisi, priced at $15. 1918D, Francis, The Night of Assisi, a must-have for your grandkids on DVD. Next up is the St. Francis Pet Medal. It's only $7 for this jewelry piece, and it's D805 St. Francis Pet Medal. We also have the St. Francis with Animals statue, priced at $55, pictured on your screen, item number 46696. Or there's the St. Francis Rosary. Now it's priced at $80, item number is 169LF for the St. Francis Rosary. Or there's the St. Francis Towel Cross, Priced at $20, item number is 41420, the St. Francis Tau Cross. We also have the popular San Damiano Crucifix, priced at $59, item number is 40702 for the San Damiano Crucifix, priced at $59. There's also a San Damiano Pendant and Holy Card. The set is $16, item number is CRS39 for the San Damiano Pendant and Holy Card. There's also a little book on the San Damiano Cross, an explanation, UP102 is the item number for this little book, put together by Father Michael Scanlon of Steubenville. Next up, Prayer of St. Francis Stone Plaque, it's $49. Item number P77, the Prayer of St. Francis Stone Plaque, it's priced at $49. And finally, we have the St. Francis Outdoor Statue, as you can see, it's item number 90789, and it's priced at $162.50. It's the St. Francis Outdoor Statue. Now moving on to some classic items from Mother Angelica, the popular book, Marian Shrines of Italy, priced at $13. Item number is 1947, Marian Shrines of Italy. There's also the book, The Glories of Mary, Put together by Reverend John Duffy, it's only $8. Item number is 36022, The Glories of Mary. And finally, from Mother Angelica, Mary Day by Day. This book is $9, and its item number is 18009, Mary Day by Day. So if you'd like to order any of the items featured on this particular program, just go to our website, www.ewtnrc.com. RC for Religious Catalog and Really Catholic. And you can find all of the items featured on this particular television program. In fact, all the items offered by our EWTN Religious Catalog and its television program are available 24-7 on our website. Of course, you can always call us at 1-800-854-6316 if you'd prefer. And you can use your Visa, MasterCard, Discover, and or American Express 
whether you're on our safe and secure internet site or when ordering over the phone. And now, here's Barbara. When Mother Angelica founded EWTN Religious Catalog, she hoped we would be the most widely known and trusted source for religious articles and other items to help our viewers deepen their knowledge and understanding of the Roman Catholic faith. You have many choices when deciding where to purchase Holy Reminders. Every purchase made directly supports the important work and mission of EWTN. We sincerely appreciate your choice to support us through your purchases from Religious Catalog.